This video is brought to you by Hoodbeast.com. Design your own custom hoodies. Hoodbeast.com. We are beast. Yo, what up, it's Don? Sammy Lee here. We are the Soul Brothers. How are you guys doing? Soul Squad, I see you. Uh, let's step right into this video. This is the first impressions, our first impressions, on the brand new LeBron Soldier 11. Uh, what is this colorway called? I don't even know. Something. Damn, what was it called? God. I don't know, man. Anyways, doesn't really matter. It's a nice black colorway, icy outsole. Uh, we've been stepping around in these all day, haven't played in them yet. Of course, we're gonna do a full performance review. But let's just break it down a little bit. Yes. Uh, let's start with this traction. Uh, the outsole is a fully translucent, except for, except for the uh, Nike swoosh. And uh, the LeBron logo. And the LeBron logo. It's um, switched. They switch it up. But it's a uh, translucent outsole, and it's like this triangle pattern. Yes. Interesting. I mean, it was sticking like crazy on the locker. Uh, in this in the store yeah. and on my wood floor so traction seems to be pretty damn good but of course with a translucent outsole we're going to have to test if it's okay on dust yeah you never know um, so, so we'll, we'll start hitting the courts with these and see if it's really gonna be uh, standing up but it's a very hard rubber I think outdoors they'd be fine yeah uh, they wouldn't wear down too fast but, which is cool yeah but the scary part about this is you're relying like basically all of the attraction uh, uh, stopping power on the rubber compound yeah so it's like this pattern really doesn't really move with your foot you know like yeah. in the Kyrie twos you know or like the hyper dunks the rubber actually kind of moves and helps stop but this feels like it doesn't yeah the, 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 you know the rubber doesn't budge at all yeah and to top that off the lines aren't very sharp and jagged exactly which a lot of times allows it to easily grab especially through dust yeah so but hopefully the compound is really good because that's maybe first and foremost the best uh thing most important thing for attraction exactly um, all right moving on uh the midsole all right so it's just a full-length phylon mm -hmm. um there there it's so why is it so hard to find specs on this uh, I mean, I because well, it's like not really out yet. Yeah, I guess it's like a baby release. It's a baby release, but um, it's, so yeah, obviously I'm thinking. But we is, saw the the dismantling. Oh yeah, yeah, it's right here. Yeah. So um, the, uh, this is probably a phylon, a full length phylon. Yeah. And it's stiff as hell. Yeah, it's pretty stiff. Pretty damn. There stiff. are some zoom units. There's one in the forefoot. Yes. Um, and one in the heel. I could feel both of them just a little bit. Same with me. You know, um, but. Uh, Nothing crazy. Yeah, but then uh, the is it me or the insole is super plush? Yeah, that's pretty pretty nice. Yeah, it feels it look, feels like a memory foam, so I really like that. Yeah, but um, yeah, so the um, four foot zoom unit is eight point two four millimeters thick, uh, which is standard. Yeah, and then in the heel, it's super duper thick. It's fourteen point zero seven millimeters thick. Yeah, that's real thick. That's she thick out. She's definitely thick. Yeah, so I mean. Yeah, yeah it feels know. responsive. Um, I feel like you're gonna get a little bit of impact protection. There's not a ton of bounce or slop, nope. which uh, which is good, which is what we like. But I do feel a little high off the ground. Yeah. You know, so um, I don't know. We'll see. And then um, you know uh, the zoom units are bottom loaded too. Right. So that that's also not gonna help us feel the zoom units any more. Yeah. Um, but you know uh, it should be okay. I I feel like. Um, so now moving on to the upper, you know, it's a blend of two materials um, in the toe and kind of like the outer uh, part. It's, you of know what's crazy? Without the straps, it looks like a uh, like a Jordan Eleven. Really? The shape of this suede wrapping around. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I mean, as to where where this is suede, it would be patent, patent leather, leather. Yeah. On the Elevens. Yeah. So this is a nice suede material. Feels nice. Yeah, and then in the middle, like the midfoot part, it is a mesh, foam back mesh upper. Um, you know, it's a good material. It's uh, supportive mm -hmm. and uh, soft at the same time. So, you know, uh, materials I'm not too mad at. But let's get into these straps, dog. We got four straps. Four straps. Not three straps. Three straps are so 2016. Yes. This is 2017. Um, we're all a little bit smarter, a little bit uh, more wise. And so what do you do? You add another strap. Up where, by where the ankle is, but yeah. these straps are dope. I, I like the straps. Yeah. I like that they're a little bit thinner, um, and they do stretch a little bit yeah. um, in the middle parts. 
the oh, where the velcro is it obviously doesn't stretch but there is a little bit and that stretches mm -hmm. just a tiny bit i don't know why they did that i think they should have left it a little bit more mm -hmm. so it could stretch a little more but yeah. you know whatever um but so you know if you like the look of the straps or you don't i don't know we're, we're gonna just tell you how it performs yes and then uh another thing to mention is that the material is double layered so there is a uh, dissuade material and then underlaying that is a obviously a um, un an underlay yeah for support uh, yeah, synthetic material whatever it is and then there is this neoprene um underlay of course yeah. for the one booty upper and there are these achilles pillows which is nice been nice we love that and i feel like the lockdown is pretty damn nice so. um what one quick thing i want well let's get into fit yes okay fit um i went down uh i actually went down a whole size really and i'm decent um so i feel like you could go down half a size um or even go true to size depending on how wide your foot is i i i feel like true to size would be good but he has a really narrow foot. i got a really narrow foot but i feel like this is narrower than more uh, most lebrons have been yeah you know, it feels like a pretty normal slash a little narrow um so i'm not too mad because yeah. you know usually lebrons are super wide so uh, i don't know about the fit it's kind of weird but yeah. maybe they changed it up a little bit and make it made it a little bit narrower but you know i feel like true to size is okay yeah moving on to um to kind of like uh, the support and lockdown aspects of of the tech the straps are crazy yes like the reason i feel like i can wear, really wear a 13 i had a 13 and a 14 in the store tried them both on the reason I, my third my foot is very very close to the to the toe but the the lockdown is so gnarly that my foot's not going to hit uh, the front here. I hate that. Uh, you know, I hate that I hate too. That. And so these straps are, are pretty gnarly, especially in the forefoot. It really holds your foot down. Really? It, oh yeah. I didn't feel it. I didn't do it yet. So. Yeah, it, it was, I cranked it down and you can squeeze the hell out of your foot. Really? And it's quick, you know, you get right in and it's not that hard to take off and on the shoe. Yeah, yeah. Which is pretty cool. Yeah. Another thing is it wraps up around the ankle. Yeah. But this, there's no ankle support. Yeah. It, it's like, it feels like, like a load to me. Yeah. yeah. So, so, I mean, this, this strap here is almost not even necessary. Yeah. No, I think you need that strap. I don't it, know. I mean, really? it's, it doesn't feel like it's doing much. I don't know. We'll have to ball on him and see. Yeah. But, you know, that's our first impressions. I am actually pretty impressed. I like the feel of it. Yeah. Uh, I feel like it's going to be a, it's a, it's going to be a really good shoe for bigger dudes, you know, uh, forward and stuff like that. So, um, one thing I'm not a fan of is see how the, the zoom in protrudes a little bit. Yeah. I'm not really a fan of that. I feel like I'm kind of like off center a little bit. Yeah. But uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We uh, shall see. That's our first impressions. Uh, the shoes, uh, I think these sold out. Foot Locker has some. 140? 140. They're 140, um, but there's a new, the, the white. white and yeah. gold colorways coming out any day now. Yes. So they'll be available. Um, stay tuned for the performance review. Make sure you're subscribed, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Soul Brothers later. Peace.